<laughs> Meanwhile, White House press secretary and bleached minion Sean Spicer <laughs> launched his own war against leakers by holding random phone checks of White House staffers. He's got to do something. He knows for a fact there's one guy in the White House who keeps sending out unhinged tweets at 3 a.m. It's nuts. <laughs> He's got to find him. So, with all of this going on, it is no surprise that on Saturday, Trump tweeted, I will not be attending the White House Correspondents Association dinner this year. Please wish everyone well and have a great evening. <laughs> That's disappointing. It's disappointing, I gotta say. It's not disappointing, but it's not his fault. That night, he's already scheduled to be at the Kremlin Correspondents' Dinner. <laughs> he's a, it's double booked. He's double booked. <laughs> Nothing he can do. Like Robert Glass. Darn it, poor planning. <laughs> but Trump spokesperson and 35-year-old who still hangs around the sorority house, Sarah Huckabee, <laughs> offered up a convincing analogy to explain why Trump would skip the event. I think it's kind of naive of us to think that we can all walk into a room for a couple of hours and, and pretend that some of that tension isn't there. Uh, you know, one of the things we say in the South, if a Girl Scout egged your house, would you buy cookies from her? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Though I'm from the South, and that is definitely yeah. an expression we use all the time. <laughs> Right. Down right. south, the Girl Scouts are horrible, horrible people. <laughs> they will murder you. But I do love the Thin Mints. <laughs> it's too bad Trump's not going to go, because I'm sure he would have given a hilarious speech. I mean, can you imagine? Well, you don't have to. <laughs> Jim? And now, delivering his 2017 White House Correspondents' Dinner Address, please welcome to the podium President Donald Trump. Thank you, thank you. Great crowd. If you like enemies of the American people... <laughs> Nothing, huh? Okay, uh... Hey, uh... Any Latinos in the audience tonight? <laughs> well, give it a minute, you're being arrested! Ice Ice Baby! <laughs> you know, because, uh... I like getting rid of Latinos. You suck! I don't suck! You know what that is? That's knock knock. Who's there? Fake. Fake who? Fake news. <laughs> this guy knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> Look, he's not wearing any pants. <laughs> okay, it's happening again. No! <sighs> it's okay, Donnie. It's just a dream. You're not even going to the White House Correspondents' Dinner this year. They can't hurt you here. Hey, look, he wet the bed! What? No! We have a great show for you tonight. The Connie Britton is here. But first, I'll be over there talking fake news with an old friend.